Let's talk about projects. Projects in ChatGPT let you collect your files in one focused workplace where we can prompt them. Think of it as a notebook LM from Google, just here in OpenAI. However, we don't have audio overviews yet. These projects can't be shared with team members, so and are designed for a single topic. Chats, that is because we upload files. To create a new project, I go to new project, and then we can give our project a name. I will call this one Workplace Insights. And I choose to create the project. Then I can add files and instructions. Let's first add some files. Here, click Add Files. And if I go back to the lesson files again in the custom GPTs and projects, I go to HR data. Here I have an absence report of our company. I have an employee satisfying satisfaction survey and some exit interviews. Pick these three while you press control on your keyboard. That will select these. And then they will upload. You can upload up to 20 files. And again, you can use PDF, Word, Excel, text, CSV, JSON, PowerPoints, and Markdown documents, and a few more. But those ones were the most accessible. So right now, you will see that it has uploaded. It says that file content may not be accessible. As long as it's, it is data, it is accessible. I can check that by closing it here. And then I can say, what does the absence report say? If I do that, I will get a summary. Here you can see it overall absence trend. So that works perfectly. Then to go back to the project, I just click over here. This is the project overview. We can also add more files that is just to go down here and add more files. Let's add some instructions. That is, we want to instruct this project how to behave. So if I go here, I could say something like use the provided references to help analyze workplace trends, focus on summarizing insights, comparing departments, identifying patterns over time and suggesting practical HR actions when relevant. Keep your responses concise, structured, and professional, like this. Then I hit save. Now I told my project how to behave. Then we can start using it again, we can prompt it. Let's say I want to summarize key patterns and concerns across departments based on the employee satis satisfaction survey. Highlight differences in ratings and recurring themes in comments. Then it will look in my documents. Here you will see that the satisfaction is 3.2 in average, 2.9, 3.5, 3.3, and operations 3.6, and engagement, leadership, trust, trust, and career growth. Then we have some recurring team themes in the comments from uh, the exit themes, positive notes, and concerns. Then we also have suggested HR actions. For example, like a career growth framework, prioritize career development and feedback structures for finance and IT. Again, to add in a new prompt in a new context, then I just go over here to the workplace insight. You can also see that the old chats are showing up here in the project. 
if I go up here, it took a little bit too long to just write. I can also click the microphone. Analyze monthly absence trends by department. Identify any outliers or concerning patterns and suggest where further investigation might be needed. Then it will do voice to text. Much easier to talk than it is to write, especially if you sit in a lonely office like me, I don't disturb anyone. Now it will analyze all the data in the workplace. And then it will, here we have it, concerning patterns and outliers, HI departments, significant spikes in absence days during September. I can also choose to follow up by visualizing the things. Let us go to a new chat. Let's say I also want to, for example, answer an email, then I can go to the lesson files, I go into custom GPTs and projects into the HR data, here I have an email. Yes, in the real world, this would be an outlook, but it will be the same. I just copy the email, I want help to reply on that. And here I can use my workplace. Here I can just say, help me answer this email, shift enter two times, say control V paste in the email. Now I get a nice answer. Here's a professional. And you will see that it makes sources, for example, from the exit exit interviews, really nice, I can further brainstorm with it. And finally, let me go up to workplace insights. Here I can also choose to real time talk to the content of the project that is the project files and with the instruction here. So if I take on my headphones, Hello, chat GPT. Hey there, how's it going? What's what on your does mind the today? files for the project shows? Can you give me some insights? Sure, I took a look at the exit interviews and there are some key insights from different departments. Uh, for example, in the finance department, employees felt there was a lack of growth opportunities and a missing feedback culture. Great, great, uh, great. stop that, stop that there. How can I improve on that? What initiatives should I launch in the company? We are a company of 100 people and we are a production facility. Since you're a production facility, a great initiative could be to create clear career paths and training programs. That way... And we can follow up on this. Your next ChatGPT video around using ChatGPT for advanced Excel is right here.